Hello everybody, Torx here. I'm going to be doing a little tutorial on how to re-oil up case fans for computers. You have a fan in your computer that's old or it's making some buzzing noises or like grinding type noise or it's noisy or you can visibly see that it's spinning slower. Oftentimes you can actually save it by re-oiling it up instead of having to buy a new one. So how do you do this? All you have to do is locate the back side of it where you can see the wire right here. Obviously this side where it is intaking air you don't see any wire. Where it is exhausting air, it's where you see the wire. And as you can see, this is an old dusty fan. I gotta clean it. But all you do is lift up this sticker. You just use your fingernail. Now, you may have already seen videos on this, and that either the ball bearing will be exposed, or in the video you'll show that there is a rubber cap in the way that you pry off. However, in the, I mean, don't do what I just did. It's probably better if you don't completely <laughs> take off the sticker. Just try to lift it up a little bit. That was an accident. However, sometimes you get this where you just see a hunk of plastic glued in the way and you can't seem to lift it out with any tool. How do you oil this up? Well, this is the only realistic way you can do it and it's something you're going to have to do at your own risk if you wish to do it. Again, completely at your own risk if you wish to do it. But there is a way you can still oil up a fan like this and that is by cutting out the plastic with a knife. Now the plastic's pretty soft, it's pretty easy, you just have to kind of dig out there. As long as your knife is sharp, keep in mind the plastic is very soft and easy to grind at. Just make sure there's absolutely no plastic shavings getting inside of it or in the fins or anything like that. You don't want to create more noises. Now right here I'm already seeing the ball bearing is exposed. But I'm going to keep grinding away. Now you just got to oil it up. Now what kind of oil do you want to use? Well, any sort of machine oil will do. Anything you can get at Walmart or anything like that. But what I'm using, this is an oil actually designed for folding knives. Uh, but it, like, you know, something like this right here, because I'm into knives and stuff. But you're just putting oil on top of the barrier here. Just make sure it's not too much. Some people will just say one drop. Yeah, that's probably what you want to do. Just carefully. Boing. I'm actually going to put a little more. It's on there, and then as you spin, as you rotate the fins, you'll notice how it gets easier and easier. Now this is a fan I'm just using as an example right here, because I tested this out myself on a fan I had that actually was, it was the same exact model fan by the way, but the thing was it was so stiff, it was actually making buzzing noises, I could visibly see that it was slow, and then when I would spin the fins it would kind of just like stop after half a second with my fingers. So I just oiled it up, I put the sticker back on, and I put it back on the computer, turned it on, and had it on for a long time, and it hasn't had any issues. The buzzing noise went away, the fins sped up, I haven't had any problems with it whatsoever. Just make sure it's real. your sticker's really sealed back on there tightly, because you don't want oil spilling or anything like that. In fact, you may want to even dab the oil out a little bit, in case you think there's too much of it on there. And that's it, that's how you oil up a ball bearing on a computer fan. If you looked this up on forums, online, a lot. If you're like me, you've come across a lot of postings saying, no, do not even try, don't put oil on your fans, get a new fan, it's shot, these things are supposed to last forever, blah, 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 blah. I proved to myself firsthand that's not always the case. Maybe those people had bad experiences, maybe not all fans can be done with that, who knows, but again, this is sort of a do-at-your-own-risk type of thing, but if you want to, I feel like it's very simple. I haven't had any issues with it myself, um, but if anyone wants to comment down below, that explain why you may not want to do this, feel free to, but in my experience, I have not had any issues with this. This works just fine. I resurrected a fan that they no longer make anymore. Anyway, that's it. That is how you oil up a fan for a computer.